yeah hello all welcome back hello yeah so in this session we are going to deal with one of the controls in condition type controls which is nothing but condition index okay what is that okay condition index. Condi condition index. index index so where can we find it in the condition type controls for which what is the transaction we use b slash 06 right B/06. yeah now let me open b slash 06 see here let me go through one of our condition type which is nothing but mr double zero here so now let me select this and let me go through it see here you can see condition index right mm, yeah. this one okay so if it is checked then only this condition type will be allowed for the condition index concept okay if it is unchecked then this condition type will not be used for condition index concept so whenever you have created the new condition type at that time only we have to check this condition index okay 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 what it means is we have to activate the condition index functionality from the beginning of the implementation means whenever means uh, at the time of implementation only we have to check this one then you may get a doubt that what will happen if you activate the what is this condition index in the condition type controls in the middle of the project then the previous condition records will not be get updated so here the condition index first of all let me tell you what exactly the purpose of the condition index condition index will help us to display or change the list of all the condition records in a single line what is that the purpose of it is nothing but which help to display and change all the condition records in a single line okay so for example if we take mr00 okay which consists of multiple records right so for which the price is 100 and for which for example customer and material combination for which the price is 100 and customer price list combination for which the price is 120 and material with the release status yes material with the release status for which the price is 150 okay so if we have many condition records like this and if you would like to make the changes to all of them in a single phase okay and if you would like to display all of them in a single phase then what you have to do you have to activate the functionality of the condition index okay so we have to do it from the beginning of the project right so now let me let me tell you what exactly the process we have to follow so if you are going to create a new condition type then what you will do you will create the condition records first right so now i am going to create one condition record for which i would like to take the key combination as sales organization okay and now let me select it and let me save it in the package see now the table 
534 is going to be create okay yeah a 534 which is the table which is going to be generate now see this is what the table was generated and what we have to do now we have to create access sequence right so now let me go through this less zero still and here let me go through new access mr 02 okay this is what is the mr 02 access sequence what is the table which was created now 534 534 so now let me select this and let me go through the accesses and here in the new entries we have to give the table 534 so now let me select again this one and let me go through the fields see i have saved it now right so what is the access m r02 so what we have to do now we have to create a condition type right so for which we use the transaction with plus 06 and here let me take the default one pr00 and let me make the changes to it as mr02 and here the access sequence is mr02 so what is the, yeah so this is what is created now mr02 condition type is created now right see this one okay okay use for condition index okay see what is the main field here if we would like to use the concept of or the functionality of the condition index we have to check this one condition okay. index here okay so this is what is already checked here right so now you can save it okay then if you would like to create the condition index then what you have to do is you have to go through logistics here see in the easy access who will work in the easy access menu end users right end users yes so you have to go through the logistics here then sales and distribution then master data then here conditions then here see select using condition index right okay. so here you can find three options create condition change conditions and display condition here you can find the what is this transaction codes also let me do that let me go through extras and settings and see here if you click on the last one here display technical names and if you click on s here then if you go through the same path logistics and sales and distribution then here what is that master data then here conditions and here select using condition index see now you can able to see the transaction codes right okay see now v slash uh, sorry v underscore i7 this is what is to create the condition so here only the sales are is the key combination so in which we have to maintain the records For example see jump 100 okay so for which the price is 100 and here sorry this is the unit of measure we have to give the key so now you can save it so like this if you create multiple condition records 
you can display all of them in one single page okay so what is the transaction we used to create the condition index v underscore i7 right and we use the transaction v slash i5 to change the conditions see here actually right now we have created one condition type what is that mr02 so in which we have created only one condition record but previously we have created mr00 in which we have given multiple condition records right mr00 in which we have given multiple condition records with different key combinations as we said customer with material and customer with price group and only material so like this we have given many key combinations for which the price is 150 and here the price is 130 and here it is 100 for example so like this we have created many condition records right so now i think you are clear how can we create the condition index at the first time yeah. so now i will let you know how can we change the conditions this one as we are not having enough conditions in mr 02 because Zero. that's what we have created now itself only so now for which i will take mr 00 this is what which we have created earlier right and for which we can see the condition index field was already checked in the condition type controls now let me show you that this last zero. see here mr00 right? our base price see for which the condition index was already checked right yes so now what i will do i will use the transaction v slash i5 see we are going to change the or we are going to see whatever the condition the records were maintained in the condition type mr00 okay we can use them uh, means we can we can make the changes to them and we can view also them in a single page that's what is the main purpose of the condition index see here i would like to display all the condition records exist in the condition type mr00 okay so for which i am going through condition c select using index okay so here i am taking the last option and here i am taking only the sales organization as the entry here now if i execute then whatever the condition records are there in that combination that will be get displayed here can you see yeah yeah so b 007 is the condition type and distribution channel and if it is this material then the discount is 18 rupees okay and for mr00 and if the material is a then the price is 100 this is what we have created for i think uh, bomb concept and see this is the keyboard monitor mouse for all of them we have maintained the prices in the previous sessions right so here we can view all these condition records and if you want you can make the changes also for example see here for the material a what is the price material a 100 100 so now I would like to make the changes to it as I would like to change the price as 140. Okay. So like this you can make the changes to all of the records in one single shot. 
here in, in here in in one single page and you can make the changes to the discounts also whatever it may be okay okay are you clear with it clear clear, clear. yes yeah, see now we have made the changes to the material here right so for which the previous mm -hmm. price was 100 but now it was changed to 140 so now i am going to save it and see if we create the sales order for the material a now okay so what will be the price Yeah. See for the material A, if we go through the conditions here, see the price is 140 here. This one. So I think you are clear with this concept. And if you have any queries in this regard, you can ask me now. Yeah, are you clear? Okay, okay. Yeah, clear. Okay, then thank you.